It was early in 1974 when Ted started acting differently towards me, where we weren't spending as much time together as we had been. He'd just like drop out of my life for three days or whatever. And God, I'd go back over our last conversation like, did, what did I say? What did I do? This was a pattern that always made me feel like I was a, a shrew. When we'd have conflict, I would be really upset. I'm raising my voice and he would just get calmer and calmer. And it was just, it was crazy making. He and my mom were not as close as they had been. They didn't spend as much time as they had spent. He didn't come over for a really long time and I thought he might not come back at all. And I, I was concerned that he wasn't gonna come back at all. My mom was worried all the time and she was drinking more at that time. She felt that maybe he was seeing someone else. And I do remember hearing those conversations. I didn't understand what was happening there at all, but I knew it wasn't like it had been. What I knew of was men that cheat on their partners. And so that's what I thought was going on, that I'd become boring, that I was predictable, and that I needed to be somebody else. Then he popped back in and it was like nothing ever happened. One day I came home and I found him inside my apartment, which he didn't have a key, so he had the landlord let him in. He was really upset when I got home. He laid down with his head on my lap and just sobbed. He told me that he had to tell me something that was important that I would probably be shocked about. But of course I had no idea what he was really fighting against within himself. <laughs> 